Facebook are oh my god. <gasps> no! Oh chat, say hi to YouTube. We gotta do our YouTube intro. Here we go. Oh, I'm stretching. Ah! Hi, how do I start a YouTube? Hi YouTube! Hi! This is totally a brand new day when we're completely doing this, not just 10 seconds ago. We're gonna get started on episode two of The Walking Dead. Starved for help. Oh, look at this picture. You already know. I'm holding Kenny back. Like, listen, Kenny. Kenny, chill, bro. We in the woods. Oh, it's time. Three months later. Hey, my boy. What the fuck is this guy? Damn it. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Mm. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Damn. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. You'll have to have... You'll have... I can't fucking... Damn. I forgot how to read in like two you'll seconds. Ask Lily. She's the one handling the rations. Or mishandling it if you ask Kenny. He's just worried about his kid getting enough. I worry about Clementine, too. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. I like this dude's glasses. Punch him and take it from him. Kenny won't abandon us. Kenny won't abandon us. He's a good man. Mm hmm. I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal anyway? Mm. Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. Mark kind of, is that his name, Mark? He thinks I'm dangerous? He's an old racist asshole. He's just an old racist asshole. Fuck him. That's his deal. Well, he needs to get over that and start finding a way to pull his weight. Hard problems or not, we should all be out here trying to find food. That's right. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. Mm. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Okay. Uh, knock me flat. Okay, bro. Don't admit it. He wasn't there. You could have lied. Oh, yeah. Shoot that fucking bird. We're going to eat pigeon tonight. Don't risk the noise. Nah, don't do that. Don't shoot. Don't. Gunshot will bring walkers. One bird's not worth it. <sighs> yeah, I know. I'm just really freaking hungry. Motherfucker, what, you want pigeon wings for dinner? Like, what are you talking about? Shit, was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on. Kenny, we're coming. Kenny, yo. Kenny, Kenny. Oh. <gasps> this motherfucker got, he's in a bear Jesus trap. Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher, we'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off! Get it off! God damn it! Get, get it off me! Travis, <gasps> maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from them. Uh, no, we ain't raiding no one, bro. Guys, We're not gonna hurt you. Is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We Yo, Ben, your friend's a bitch. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Lee, this is fucked up. We've gotta help. Kenny, please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Oh, my God. We'll try. We got to get him out of there. Oh, God. Thank you. Fine, but you got to hurry. <laughs> hurry, please. Hurry. <gasps> Yo, cover his fucking mouth. There's no release latch. Oh, no. Shit. Walkers! It's now or never, Lee. Please! Get me out of this! Mark, get the boys back! Kenny, keep those walkers off of me! 
Am I gonna have to chop off his leg? Oh my god. Lee, do something! Oh god. I'm gonna have to cut you out. Bite down, no, my no, boy. No. Try the trap again. Anything, please. Try to cut the chain. Man, shut your bitch ass up. Give me that leg. Ah! I'm hungry. We're eating this shit tonight. Ah! We low on food, bitch. One more. Get the! Oh my god. Sever it, bro. Look, it's twitching. Give me my meal. Ah! Oh god. Shit. Is he. He passed out. That motherfucker's not surviving. If he's alive, grab him and let's go. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on. Travis! Ah! Travis, just run, Travis! What the fuck? Oh my god! Help! 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 No! Yeah, that motherfucker needed to die. What was that, Travis? That weak ass backpedal, just turn and run. He deserved to die. That motherfucker would have, he would have got me in trouble or something. Holding me back. Oh, there's this Larry looking fuck. Look at him using a rock. Useless ass motherfucker. I should chop his leg off and eat it. He got meat. Clem, where's your hat, Clem? Wait, we forgot the fucking leg? Do we pick him up and not his leg? How are we gonna eat tonight? Come on, we had one job! Should've shot the fucking pigeon then. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit, what the hell are they doing? Come on, come oh on! God. We can eat him! What happened? Oh, what the hell? What's going on? I don't have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee! I, I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. Clem is so what cute. What are you thinking? Lee, are you, you okay? Calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, your mouth. I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. We left the other one behind. Other one? Jesus, Lee. What if there are more of them? What if they followed you here? There wasn't anybody else. Just us. Why well, he sound like Morty? He's not lying. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. Uh -uh. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. Aww. What? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group? Clem is so cute. We can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not going to be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around. But now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. You've got nothing to say about that, Lee? I'm staying out of this, Kenny. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence. But sooner or later, you're going to have to decide whose side you're on. <laughs> Kenny, how you gonna be mad at me, little bitch? I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why get your don't fucking, you go help Mark with the wall? Get your daddy. Get your yeah, go help with the wall. Go fucking smack the wall with a rock, asshole. You think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food, but nobody else wants to. Hmm. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Oh. Good luck. What the fuck are food rations? Half an apple and pretzel sticks? What the fuck? The crackers with cheese? This is what we're surviving on? 
Don't look at me, Larry, because you're not eating, bitch. I gotta give it to the kids. What if we all split a cracker evenly? Like in half. Everybody gets half a cracker. No. We're not down for that. How you doing, legless man? Are you okay? We could have been eating your fucking leg, but but someone forgot it. Dang. Ah, oh, damn. What's up, girl? That ass looking fat, too. I'm gonna fuck with you. I got some crackers. You want some crackers? You know what I mean? You know Clem gotta eat. Absolutely. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. That's what I asked. Can you help me find it? Of course. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Clem is so fucking adorable, bro. <laughs> Come, take my, my food. You want crackers with cheese? Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Give half an apple. Give piece of jerky. Give crackers and cheese. Mmm. Half an apple. Jer what would be the most satisfying? A piece of jerky? Do you like jerky? That's meat. That's protein. You need that. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. If you have any more food, Duck is hungry too. Yeah. Why don't we then get some food? Um, ask the daddy. Bye. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. What have you been doing, bro? You have done nothing but hit with a rock. Want some food? Lily and Kenny need to get along. Lily wants to ditch the new people. Hmm. I don't even want to talk to you. Continue with your rock hitting, you Need stupid bastard. Wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Uh. Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. No, it's mine. Give axe to Mark. Give axe to Larry. Give axe to Mark. Here, Mark. This should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? No, I didn't. Come on. You might swing it at me, thing. asshole. Things are different. Being a racist is outdated. Oh, and that's what you think this is? Oh. Is that what you told him? It is. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. and what are you going to do about it? Look. N I not give what? you any food, you little hungry oh, bitch. God, trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. Fuck that guy. I'm tired of him, Mark. I'm really tired of him, bro. I'm gonna knock him the fuck out one day. Just not today. I'm a little hungry. I'm not giving you no food. I'm not giving Duck no food. Kenny! You want some food, Kenny? You could give it to your son. Want something to eat? Give crackers with cheese. I like Kenny. Here, Kenny, take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Uh, no. Oh. Come talk to me once my boy's taken care of. <sighs> then, Kenny, how about you take the food from me and give it to your fucking kid? I'm not giving no food to Duck. That motherfucker could starve and die. You understand me? I'm not getting shit now. Starve. Hey, Carly. You hungry? Want something to eat? I have an apple. Have an apple, Carly. God, I used to eat an apple every morning with some granola and six almonds and... Okay, I didn't ask all that. Take your fucking apple. But you know what? Yes. He's a kid? An annoying one. Here, just to be a dick. Here, Ben. I'm not giving to Ben. Fuck you. You just got here. Find your own cheese and crackers. You hungry? We could eat him later if, you know, you just silence him. Kill him. Kill him. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Yeah, of course. Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, 
This man has no leg. Yeah, I know. We were supposed to eat it. I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. The right thing is just scary sometimes, I guess. Mm -hmm. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. <sighs> I want Kenny to eat, bro. He's like, he, he saved my life. And if it means giving crackers and cheese to this stupid little fuck, take it. Hey, Doc. How about a little food? Stupid little beady eyes and face. Look at it. So excited for his little <laughs> spit on the crackers before giving it to him. Yeah. Oh, man. I'm so hungry. All I got is one left. Keep the last piece of food for yourself. Save the last piece of food for someone else. Save it for oh, someone else. Some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Oh, Lee, you're selfless. Kenny, you hungry, man? Take your crackers and cheese. Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? I fed him, yeah, Kenny. I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. Okay. You couldn't, like, at least split it? Like, yeah, let's split it, partner. No? Nothing? Piece of shit. It's That's done. That's such an easy job, is it? It was really easy, to be honest with you. Oh, you mad! You mad, Mark! I, you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. Piece of I shit. Don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. Yeah, of course. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out. What happened to my food? Fuck your food, you fat None bastard, left. bitch! You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yo. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. That little ass raggedy ass wall ain't gonna keep shit out. Fuck out of Ken, Lee. I'm so tired Please. of Larry. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. Uh, God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Let's eat him. Ken, come back. There's nothing. I'm sick of this shit, too. I'm sick of this shit, too. You don't think I am? Ugh. I don't know. Maybe it's for the best. We're already struggling to feed our own kids. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? Does that mean, like, my kill count went up? I pretty much killed him, right? Does that mean I killed a dude with, with one leg? The peg leg? I have to. I, I think my kill count's like five, six, maybe? I'm really out here. I'm a killer in these streets. Stop playing with me. <gasps> oh my god! He was big, yo! Kenny! The axe! Hurry! Give me the ah! The axe! The axe! Mitch! Bitch! Wanna play with me? I'ma eat you! Move, move! Move! Shit, it's stuck! Oh my fucking god, you're lying! Mark! 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 Oh my fucking Mark! You dumb bitch, Mark! What the fuck? That's how you go. You gonna act like you, you, I know he meant to do that because I didn't give him no fucking, uh, no crackers with cheese. Move, move. Fuck you, Mark. So un unenthusiastic talking about some. Move, move. Go. Go, 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 go. Kick him. Kick his fucking head. Get the fuck off me. Mark. S. S. Mark! Do something! Shoot it! <sighs> fuck. You okay? Yeah. Thanks. Oh my Why'd god. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Ah, uh, don't have another heart attack. Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? 
What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. Oh. Uh. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. Oh, shit. God help us. God help us. It makes sense. In those first few days, it spread so fast. Car accidents, suicides, everything was making more of them. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God... Back off! Oh. Whoa, lady, relax. Uh, me and my brother, we we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off! Back off, asshole! Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Uh. Dead could be anywhere. But uh, I think you got the upper hand here. I Why don't do trust that? him. Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If, if y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Oh, fuck. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. Good shit, Carly. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? Mm. We'll go to the dairy with you, my boy. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. I don't like a his face. Should power one of our generators for a while. I don't trust so that guy. This dairy. You guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. I agree, this Carly. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. I agree. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Oh, really? Hmm. Really, so Carly, what's up? You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Yeah. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine knows. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly did happen with the senator? <sighs> it was an accident. Somehow, I ended up getting locked. It was an accident. I mean, I, I pretty much knew about the affair. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. Mm -hmm. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've mm -hmm. seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I really appreciate that. I appreciate that, Carly. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Don't worry Where about me. From? Don't worry about that. I ain't talking to you. I plead the fifth. Some tells me you're a local boy. <laughs> you can always just kind of tell, you know? Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? It's a democracy. We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Whoa, whoa, whoa. That is... Oh, pause. Who asked that, bro? I don't... Tr that shit is sus. What? How many people... We got hundreds. We got hundreds of people over there. All got guns, armed. We got food. Fuck out of here. I don't like this motherfucker. I'm not talking to him. We've got a lot of hungry folks back there who really appreciate your food offer. Mark! Well, here's to helping each other out. Well, oh my God, you snitch bitch! Food. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. 
Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember. Oh, your mama? Uh, now it's. You getting... think you're gonna cut me out of this? Oh. Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who Calm raided down. my You're camp. Who are they? Shh. Fuck you! Fucking you knew we were hungry, and are. you guys were keeping it There's all There's only two of them. Oh no, there's yeah, a lot more Yeah, you know what? We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens, but let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! Oh. <gasps> Fuck you! Fuck you! Jesus! Asshole. The world out here has gone to shit. Come on. Uh, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. It's lovely here. Let's keep some out. <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. Mm. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Damn, I want to live here. Oh, hey, Mama. This is a brilliant setup. This is a really brilliant setup. Suits us just fine. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our Mama. I'm hey, Mama. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He, uh, you, you never did say where you're from. You were right. I'm a local boy. Hmm. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Ah. You got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Of course. Of course, we work together. We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hmm. hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Thank you. We brought gasoline. Thanks for having us. We brought some gasoline on good faith. We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Ooh. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. Ah, damn. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks Mark. out. Mark! A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! <sighs> Maybe our whole group could come. Mark! Shut the fuck up! Fuck! Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. Mm. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Alright, see you soon. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. Mm. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. Mark. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. Mark. If we play our you need cards to right, chill, this bro. This turn out to be a place we can stay. Mark. How do you want to play this? Mark, I want you to shut the fuck up. All right? I want you to shut the fuck up. Let's make sure this place is safe, you stupid motherfucker, and stop telling all of our business, Mark. Mm. Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously, they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but mm. maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. Mm. And checking the fence perimeter sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right, mm. I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Bet. Say no more, Mark. <sighs> Do a 
feeling good over there, Mark. I'm gonna walk the perimeter. Okay. Check out the swing. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play. Fuck on. Duck. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. So where's, uh, where's the kids at? When was the last time it got any use? Mm, been quite a while, and uh, don't exactly have a lot of kids visiting anymore. I look forward to the day when kids can just be kids again. Amen to that. Amen. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Oh, fuck yeah, I'm gonna fix the swing. Let's do it. Get over there, bro. You're just looking at the fence. You can definitely tell they built this thing themselves. God damn. How you doing, bro? You just chilling? Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Hmm. Hmm. We've scraped together a good supply in the last few months. How about yourselves? What kind of protection do you have? Yeah, what protection do you have? We collected a few guns to protect ourselves, but we really only use them when we go off the property. When we're inside the perimeter, the fence is all we need to keep us safe. Mmm, the fence stops the walkers? An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. Mm. He used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. Uh, like us. Mm. Uh, are we your first guest? We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Hmm. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. <laughs> well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, yeah, bet. that'd be a big help. That sounds great. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Right, 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 bro. Right, right, right. Yo, Mark, come over here, Mark. I don't know if I trust these motherfuckers, bro. Something's off about his face. He just don't look right. He look evil. Something, I don't know. And did you see his mama? Thick as hell, but... So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? Mm. As if tensions weren't high enough. Sorry, man. It just it popped out. Yeah, like I mean, everything else? He did admit it right to his face. <sighs> I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. There's one. Is that a bow and arrow? Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Uh, call. Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for target practice? Uh, poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was already dead. Pull that fucking arrow out. Disgusting. Push this asshole off. Get out of here. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, mm -hmm. this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Bro, Mark, chill. It's useless without gas. Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. I don't Not like many Mark. drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas. Easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. Uh, They're delaying the inevitable. We can take this place if we have to. 
What do you mean? What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. No, bro. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's all. Thanks. Okay, I appreciate that, Mark. There's Thank you, another dude. one. I see it. Uh, that motherfucker look like he is lost. Ill, maybe not. Oh my god, let go of that! Bad hands. No more. Don't touch the gate. No more. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Christ, I can't stop thinking about dinner. Bro, Mark. Would have been nice to get some of those rations. I get hungry too, you know. Ah, uh, you mad? Ah, uh -huh, you mad? I'm hungry too, ass. So I didn't eat. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're gonna be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Damn. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Little help here, Lee? I fall, bro. I got you. Q, 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 Q. Holy fuck! <gasps> what just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Ah! Oh my ah! god! <laughs> what the? Get to the gate! <gasps> oh! Get down! You asshole! Jesus! Mark! Now you're fucked! Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With a fence on that gate, it's our only way out. Jump that shit. What do we do? Up? Okay, they're not gonna fucking listen. Let's push the tractor. Yeah, push that. Help me, Mark. Do this all day. It's over here. Give us the food. Fuck you. Get your own food, assholes. Get closer. Damn. You don't see shit. <laughs> Fuck you guys. Go. Oh. This is the lever. No fuel. Of shit. course. <sighs> oh my god. I don't know what to do. Oh my fucking god, Mark. Shit, something's still blocking it. What's blocking it? Move. Oh, the little fucking block right there. What is that? Move that shit. Come on. Yeah, yeah, let's go. Gate. We let's go, Mark. This fence and back to the house. Ah, they're all shit, that hurts. Mark, you good, bro? You good? Just stay low, stay low, stay low. They're using bows and arrows and shit. We good? Ah ha, y'all mad? Y'all mad? You don't got your food? Oh my fucking god! What happened? Shit! It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. I'm gonna have to move. Oh my god! Move that shit. Get up. Go. Fuck you guys. Why is there another dead body? Another one? How many of those things did we push down? Oh, go, 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 go. Push this motherfucker. Get out the way. Mark! Give us the food! I don't have no food for you! Ah! We have ah. Now you're Get off me! You yeah, really bitch! You, you okay? Yeah. Uh, Barry. Come on! The gate's <gasps> right there! It's crawling behind us! Oh my god! You got lucky, Just go! Let's get out of here. Fuck. You lucky sons of bitches. Aha, uh -huh, y'all mad you ain't getting no food from us pussies. Bro, help. Mark is hurt. Lee, what's wrong? Uh, 
The electric fence came on. The electric fence came on. Some people started attacking from the woods, and we got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit, are, are you okay? I got an arrow in I him. Heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real sorry. Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be all right once it's out, but god damn. Hey, mama. Hey, y'all. Mark, oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on, Brenda's got you. Come on inside I'll now. go ahead, Brenda. you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? Oh my god, Larry. People on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. It isn't safe here. Maybe it isn't as safe here as we thought. Look, we're sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. Let's get them. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Oh, bet. Say no more. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find mm. a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, oh, cool shit. Jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm going to head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly Where's and Ben Clem? ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. Hope you kids like swings. Thank you. The swing! Clemmie! Just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime. Doc, you better let We're Clementine swing, it. asshole. Don't be hogging that swing. Where the fuck is the swing at? Don't be hogging that, Duck. You better be pushing. Let me find out. Duck. Duck. Kenny. Kenny, you better get your kid off my goddamn swing. You understand me, Kenny? Because I'll really rock you like Larry did. Don't play with me, little bitch. I, I got the axe in my inventory. Look at it. Peek it. Stop playing with me. Hey, Clem. Do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you push me on it? Yeah, of course. Clemmy, you are here. Sure. Come on, Clemmy. Push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Yeah, fuck out of here, stupid ass Duck. Move. Hogging the shit. Look at y'all. Looking mad as hell, huh, Duck? Ah hi, you mad? Come on, Clemmy. Uh. How you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. You good? Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? You got lucky out there. Could have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Well, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. I love that. Oh my god, dude. <sighs> What do you think about the dairy? What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure when. But one day, things have got to get back to normal. That's good. I hope it's soon. Yeah, me too. Okay, I'm not gonna say we're safe here because I don't I don't want Clem to feel safe here. All right, Clem, that's enough for now. Okay, thanks for pushing me. Of course, it's all yours. Yeah. Fuck okay, you, duck. Duck, don't pop a gasket. Stupid ass duck. Little little stupid ass kid. Look, Kenny, you you kid ugly, bro. You got an ugly ass kid. You know that ugly duckling. That's why you named him Duck. Ugly little duckling ass bitch. Let me. 
Good, Clemmy. Pat, pat, pat. Good, Clemmy. Have a good day, okay? I'm gonna go check on everybody. Look at these assholes. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Is there a cow? If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Hmm. Hey, Lily. How you doing, Lily? Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew. Yeah, but maybe. I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? I'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? I take it you and Kenny haven't made up about your dad. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. Your dad's an asshole. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Hmm. Okay, so he he's the asshole. So he's the asshole. Look. My dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. Ah, debatable. He just, he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much. And lost pretty much everything. Did he? And it's hardened him, you know? I think he needs to lose something else. Maybe, you know, his life? His fucking life? That motherfucker's going to die. I promise you that. Wait till I get a chance. Oh, wee! Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap. Mm. That's just because he still has one thing left to care about. Mm. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's mm. my dad. And I love him. I can understand that. You're so right. I can understand that. Still doesn't change the fact that he's an asshole. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. Lily, get your father. I'm going to kill him. I swear to God I am, bro. Just wait. Just wait. As soon as Lily's not looking, push him into a zombie. I'm gonna stand there, arms folded and shit. How you doing, friends? That I don't trust? Fellas. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. Yeah. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? Mm. The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. We think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Hell yeah. Let's go. Yeah, it'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Clem! Clemmy! Are you going now? Yeah, I am. I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. Aw, oh, please be lucky. I love Clem. I don't trust these guys. They look creepy as fuck. Their eyes. They're just face. They, look, they don't look trustworthy. See anything? Not yet. This fucking collared shirt. I know it's around here. But the pocket? Be close. Spaghettios can. I am hungry. Here. Oh shit. Oh shit. You found it? I see anything? Let's steal their shit. Come on. Let's go. I'm sneaking. Sneaky boy. You see anybody? I'll see no one. Can't. 
tell. Can't tell. I got your back. Watch my back, Lee. I got you. I'm gonna check out the tent. Hey, miss. Hello, is anyone home? Open that shit and shoot. Sir. Clear. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Mm. They stealing spaghettios. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Recently. Nothing but fumes. Shit. Save lots? What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Hmm, not unless you need empty cans. This is too much for one person. Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <sighs> I'll pass. Oh, what the fuck is that? Milk! Is that milk? Dairy box. Wait, that's dairy. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Mm. The fuckers cross the line. Can I see what's more in there? Is there any more? No? A shopping cart. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Hmm. A tent. Tent looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid sized. Oh shit. Lawn chair. A box. And a crate. Let's check out the box. Empty. What is that? A Game Boy! Take it for Clementine! Oh, it's a camera. What do you find? Don't worry about Video it. Video camera. Let me see that. You that good? Dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I want to check the crate. I see you oh. handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Hmm. Can we ask why that motherfucker... What, what's on the camera? Let me see it. You know what I mean? What's on, Sona? Nothing. Nothing? Damn. Don't worry about what's on the camera, my boy. Right here. Why the fuck do they have hats? The hell? Don't you fucking move. Shit! Put your guns down. I'm taking the hack! Back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. You steal my shit. Steal everything from me. What we happened? Had a deal. You people broke it first. Why are you alone up here? What happened to you? Well, that's a hell of a question, mister. They told me I'd be safe with them. Men who lived here. But it weren't safe. Not for me. Not for my girl. They didn't treat her nice. Not at all. They took her away into the woods. Wouldn't tell me where. <gasps> and I begged them every way I could think. They just laughed. <laughs> so I killed them. And I'm staying here till she comes back to me. One way or another. She'll come back. Now maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm Bitch, you think I won't kill you? Put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. 
You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it Screw all. Screw this. Shoot Take her. The you shoot. Beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What the fuck? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. What? Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter what happens, one of us is gonna kill you. Like you could kill me. They couldn't kill me. They tried. Killing everyone. Bitch, put the crossbar. Put the it head. down. Of course you won't. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for us. Oh. God damn it! You murdered that woman! You straight up murdered that woman! Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. <sighs> it's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. Huh? So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Bro. Come on. This motherfucker. You're bugging. Did I get did I get Clem's hat? And why was Clementine fucking around with this little ass bitch? I have so many questions right now. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back! What happened? Hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. How you doing, Mama? You look good, Mama. Looking this all This isn't thick. what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Mm. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. Jeez, tensions are high. Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? I'm saying that. Yeah, I could use like a massage. My shoulders are real tense if you're down. Yeah, you could say that. They don't exactly see eye to eye on how we should be doing things. Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. Mm. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. Thank you. Think I'll go have a look around. I feel don't so safe with your mama. Far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yes, you're, you're the best, Mama. I feel so safe here. Clemmy! Hey, Clem! I love Clementine! She's the best! She's so fucking adorable and sweet, and I want to protect her forever. And I'm going to give her her hat. Take your hat, Clem! I got it for you! Stupid ass duck, yo cow, bite his head off. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay, go ahead. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Shit, Clemmy's the cutest! When do you think we might eat? Danny and I met a woman in the woods. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Huh? 
Hey, me. Okay, whatever. Thanks. Yep. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! I knew you'd find it! You said you would! Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. Do you think you'll ever have kids? Yeah, someday. I'd like to someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Well, thanks for finding my hat. Clem is the best, dude. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. She looks skinny. Skinny ass cow. Fuck out of here. So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Larry, get off my girl! Fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Motherfucker, Larry spitting games to my girl. You ain't gonna talk to mama like that. That's me. Always gonna be me. You talk to Lily. He trying to get some buns in the apocalypse, bro. I mean, I respect it, but better find your own. That's how I'm gonna go talk to his daughter. Hey, Lily. I'm trying to break your back, Lily. Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? Mm, Danny shot someone. We found a woman in the woods. She was talking all crazy and had a crossbow. So Danny killed her. Holy shit. Yeah. Was she one of those bandits? I don't know. I think she was trying to tell me something. But then he just went off. I don't like this, Lee. I still say we should go back to the motor inn where we at least know what to expect. I kind of agree with you. I'm not even going to lie. What were you and Kenny arguing about? What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. Hmm. Do you get the feeling something's going on here? I get the feeling. You get the feeling something's going on here? What makes you say that? What exactly happened at the camp? Uh, it's nothing. Uh, don't worry about it. Paranoia just getting to me a little bit. I know what you mean. No, these, these people are people weird, bro. always give me the creeps. If you ask me, we should just get our dinner and leave. Hmm. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Whoa. A multi-tool? A multi-tool. That should be handy. Take it. Just gonna borrow this for a second. Not for a second. Keep it forever. If a couple of tools out in the open is as unsafe as it gets, we'll be fine here. Would have been nice to have one of these back at the motor inn. Take it. Don't be shy. Steal everything. Oh, but they go through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. Yo, Danny, why do you kill that bitch back there, bro? Hello. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. You really like that gun. You really like that gun. What's not to like? Uh, just kind of creepy. A little fucking creepy. Just kind of creepy, that's all. A little bit creepy. Times like these, a 243 will keep you warmer at night than any lady I ever known. You run this place with just one cow? How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. Hmm. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get How's he visits? stroking his Nothing gun like more. that? Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. This motherfucker, look how he's stroking it. And he's like staring into my eyes. Hell nah. Yo, Larry, stop talking to my girl. We'll, uh, we'll finish talking later. Yeah, I'm cock blocking. Fuck out of here. 
Move aside, pussy. You been getting along with Larry? <laughs> he just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? Uh, don't know if I would have used those words exactly. Don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. Mm. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity every now and then. Mm. Uh, how's Mark doing? How's Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He could definitely teach them a thing or two about yeah, being Yeah, Mark's tough. cool. I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. Okay. Uh, why are you out here instead of cooking? Uh, not to be rude, ma'am. How come you're out here instead of, you know... Oh, you want to know why I'm not slaving away in the kitchen? Is that it? Yeah. Uh, no, no, I didn't mean for it to sound like that. Oh, it's okay, darling. Got it slow cooking in the oven. Should be ready before too long. We ran into trouble out there. We ran into some trouble out there. I was just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. Yeah, it'll all, your boys is nuts. Your boy's a little crazy. Your boy Danny is nuts. No, that's not a very nice thing to say, Lee. He seemed to enjoy this woman's death. I'm sure he didn't. He is sensitive and willing to do whatever it takes. Uh, that's not what I've seen. I think I'll go have a look around. Kind of peaceful out here, ain't it? Yeah, it's a little Enjoy peaceful. It while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters frying against the fence before too long. Okay. Have a great day, Mama. All thick ass. Looking all cute. Where's Kenny at? Is Kenny over here? You found it too, huh? Kenny! Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. Hmm. Got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? Hmm. I'll protect her no matter what. I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. Hmm. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. Oh, I got a multi-tool. Back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. Mm. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. What is this? It's hey, close. Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? What? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're... You know, urban? Oh, you racist! I'm not saying what I think you're saying. <sighs> Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Kenny, urban, hmm. though? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. That's smart. All right, sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. <laughs> Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? Oh, no, nah, we just chilling. We was just chilling. Just checking out the barn. Just checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Ah. Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't yeah. fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right we ain't gonna fuck with the door. Don't worry. Why would we fuck with the door? We would never do something like that. Absolutely never. Hey, guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Oh, my fault. Come on, enough already. You're right. Yo, we need to distract him. Come on. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. <gasps> the generators. How you doing, my boy? Andy, wow, beautiful cow you have there. Hey, Clevy, Clevigans. I'm just walking, being my urban self. Let's fuck up the generator. 
You're gonna go to the generator, we're gonna go in the back door, unscrew the shits. Hit the off switch. Am I jeopardizing like everybody? Oh. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I didn't even see this. Yep. About to fuck the whole thing up. There you go. Yup, yup, yup. Go ahead and go ahead and just. Hmm. Ow! Damn it! Oh, that thing is moving fast. About the multi-tool. Ow! Damn it! That thing is moving fast. What the fuck you want me to do? Oh! Power it off. Now fuck around with it. <clears throat> thing is on too tight for my bare hands. Use the tool. He's got to come out. Yeah, there yeah, we go. That should do it. I just jeopardized everybody on this farm for a fucking door. This seems really dumb. I don't know if I like this idea. Where did he find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, dog. Oh, son of a fuck. Oh, this take forever. Damn, you sound really upset, man. I'm just gonna go into the barn and check on Clemmy. What's behind the door? Oh. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Yeah, I'm hungry. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Go eat! Kenny, Duh. come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Why the fuck am I? Why are you leaving me here? Kenny, I swear to God, if I miss out on this food, I don't like cold food, Kenny. There we go. Unscrew quick. Kenny really left me out here, bro. One more, one more, one more. Good shit. There's something there. Oh, <gasps> the bear Boy, traps. Didn't you hear the bell? Oh. <gasps> Dinner time. Oh. Uh, I found a door like that. Look, I just came in and found the door open like that. Probably my idiot brother. Uh, hey, was anyone with you just now? No. Not the doc? No, she went in the house. Oh, good. Uh, yeah, good. Okay, you're not gonna do anything, right? Let's go eat. Oh, oh, oh Brenda, Biscuit? you wow. are an angel. Oh, Excuse boy. a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I, I want a biscuit. A horse. Where's Mark? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Okay. Where the fuck is Mark? I don't trust these motherfuckers. Mark? <gasps> Squeaky ass steps. Why is there a wire there? What is that? Closet door. What the fuck are these? Morphine? Box of candles, medical supplies, towel, 
Power cord. Huh, where's that cord going? Am I hearing shit? Chat, are you hearing shit? Or is that like someone breaking into my goddamn house? I, I don't know anymore. Fuck it, if I die, I die, but... Let's check this power cord. What the hell? Fuck. You're knocking and shit. What do they need so much morphine for? Candles. Smart. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Trash. Yeah. What is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? Fuck. I just plug in. Door. What the fuck? Is that blood? Please don't tell me. This is some shady shit. His legs. Mark, what the hell happened? <sighs> Brothers. What the hell happened to your legs, man? Don't eat dinner. <gasps> hey, did you fall in? Oh my God. Clementine. <gasps> Clementine, yo, stay right there. Don't move. You really don't have an option. Clementine! Don't eat the food! Stop! Don't eat that! Don't eat that! Huh? <laughs> Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? Larry, you eat up. Stark. He can use Mark is upstairs man. legless! Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's what crazy. The hell? You're scaring the kids, Lee. Do you think I'm bullshitting? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Oh my god. Man, I was eating that. We got what is going on? They're picking us off to trade as me. You're out of your skull. Mark is upstairs right now with no legs. Brenda, tell me he's not being eaten right now. Give me a piece! I'm hungry! It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to oh. better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. You're all sick. Sick in the head. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Yo. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Oh. Uh. Can you get your gun? Clementine, run! Lily, grab a knife! Nobody's going anywhere. Oh my god. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black Put fuck? your guns down. We're walking you out of come here. Near my fucking Mommy, family. I don't want to die. Mommy, oh my god. I, I eat. Somebody do something. <gasps> Lee? Lee? Clem. <gasps> Oh my god. You you, you I'll kill, I'll you. kill you bitch! You let go of Clemmy! 
Oh my god, Mark, I know that isn't you. Oh my fucking god. Mark dragged his ass down here. Please. Someone. Ah. I will tear you fuckers you apart with my bare hands. hands. We gotta find another way out of here. <laughs> Yo, shit, <laughs> fucking bastards! Oh my Open god. This door, god damn it! I will knock the we goddamn door stop. down! It, it was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet- Come on, Dad. Now's not the you time- You gonna blame it on me?! You motherfucker, are you serious?! I told you and you talk about some- You okay, Clementine? They- They didn't hurt you, did they? Mm-mm. Oh, Ben up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here! Oh, I hope they this eat duck. This goddamn thumb sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. Oh my god. Yo, worse than the walkers. Dad, please. Yo, knock him the fuck out. Come on, Larry. Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah, I want to attract their attention. So I can fucking kill them! Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. Uh-huh. What the hell is your problem? Uh-huh. You mad? You refused to give me my day's rations back at the motor lodge. And you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. You guess what? are a- You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn, I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. Dad! Open up, goddammit! I'm not your enemy, Larry. I don't believe you. Don't forget, I know who you really are. Please settle down! I'll, I'll rip your <sighs> heads off! And, and Is this air conditioner? Hmm. I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get- uh, uh, <sighs> Easy! Yes! <sighs> yes! <sighs> Die! Die! Just let go! <gasps> Go towards the light, yes! Fuck! Finally! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh god, he stopped breathing. Go up I the think stairs! He's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead. He's not dead! You know what has to happen, Lee. Think about it. Oh you my god. Poor bastard at the motel. How fast he turned? What are you saying? <gasps> Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're going to be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back, Lee. We'll mourn him later. Oh my right god! Now we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Ken! Oh my god, Clem's He's here. Not dead. I can't do that in front of Clem. Oh my god, Lily can save him. Lily can still save him. I wish she could. Believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. Same. It's different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on. We know this guy's not going to make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come Bro. On, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. Chill, you gotta Lee. Have my back this time. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. Oh, my fucking God. Come on, Dad. Oh my fucking god, this is stressful. Fuck. We can kill this bitch ass, but at the same time, bro, I can't do that in front of Clem. I can't, I can't. You guys are saying kill him. I And Clem is there. But at the same time, what if he's actually dead and he turns into a zombie? Oh my god, Clem better fucking look in the corner or something, bro. Trauma builds character, someone said. You ain't shit. I, I can't. If I don't help... Kenny, Kenny's gonna hate me. And say he's not alive, then I gotta deal with Larry being a dick. But at the same time, I can't kill Larry just because he's an ass. Yes, the fuck I can. What am I saying? Yo, kill this motherfucker. Help, Kenny, kill that bitch. You're right, Kenny. 
Let's get this you over. You fucking monsters! Fuck you! Both Move! You. I don't want to see. I'm sorry. Lily. Look no, in the corner, no, Clem. No. Don't look. <laughs> get off me! Move, bitch! Don't Move! We gotta kill this little bastard, bitch! <laughs> no, no, no! Kill him quick before he gets consciousness. Kill him quick. No. Can he hit him with the fucking brick? Yeah, no. smash his face no. in. No. Ah. Yes. Yes. God help us. I'm sorry. I Don't know you it. fucking touch me. <laughs> Clem, no, Clem! Clementine. You okay? Why, Lee? Lily said he wasn't dead. Fuck him. Sometimes we got... We couldn't take that chance. I'm sorry. We couldn't take that chance. You understand why we had to do this, Clementine. So he won't turn into one of those monsters? Exactly. That's right. It's okay, Clemmy. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Yeah. Like what? Uh, getting out of here. Getting out of here. Getting out of here. We're gonna get out, right? Of course. We found a way out? I'm working on it. Say something now, huh? Say something now. Say, oh, you can't, huh? Be an asshole now. Oh, you gotta take a nap. Fuck out of here, pussy. Fuck you talking about, Clem. Look away. Look away. Dad is being an asshole right now. Get away. I just need to. I told you to get the fuck away. Don't get knocked out, too. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Yeah, the multi-tool. Of course they took it. Fuck. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, uh, a rock won't help. Mm. But a coin might do the trick. A coin? Do you have a coin? Uh-uh. Larry would have wanted- Fuck you! <laughs> you think he wanted this? Of course not. You don't know what he wanted. You never knew him. You never gave him a chance. Maybe not. A chance? Maybe, maybe I should have tried hard. Fuck no! But I know he loved you. You wanted a chance? He'd want you to get out of here. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. You got any cores? If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? About you, dead daddy. This is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn. Larry, Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. That's he was right. Alive and had the key to getting us out of here. Do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Yes, please. Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Thank you. I want all his money. Take his wallet. Take his shoes, too. Oh, boy. Hey, I'm gonna just check this left pocket. Here we go. Ooh wee! Two quarters and a dime. That's nice. We got the no, no. Go back. Check, check his other pockets. Can we go back, motherfucker? You lucky bitch. He's about to rob all his shit. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. All right, unscrew. Nice. That's a big ass quarter. There's our way out, Lee. It's too small to fit. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. Clem? I know you're brave enough, Clem. I know you're brave enough. I'm scared. Remember the treehouse? You held out for days. And I saved your life. That's right, Clem. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Okay. Clem is such a real one. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. You got it, Clem. Are you okay? Did anyone see you? 
Lily, we gotta go. Leave me alone. Lee, I can see him. It's not safe in here. For God's sake, Lee. Didn't even get to say goodbye. Well. Get in here. Oopsie. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Yes, sir! Larry, done. Now, duck. Duck is not- the whole shit. This is some sick shit. I told you there was something up with this room. It's a goddamn human slaughterhouse. Holy shit. Pause. I'm kind of mad I didn't get to eat. Like, I'm running on empty. I didn't eat no, no crackers with cheese, no apple. Like, I'm hungry. The, the first dude, I wanted to eat that motherfucker's leg. You know what I mean? Who, who cares who leg it is, to be honest? Meat is meat, chat. Food is food. We got to eat. Did you see the sauce on the meat when it was on the table? That shit looked delicious. Oh, oh, delicioso. Them fucking legs would have been delicious right now. Full meal. I'm pissed. Resume game. Take hay hook. Oh, I'm stabbing someone. I'm stabbing the fuck out of someone. Jars? What are these jars of? Ugh, I think I'm gonna be sick. Fucking nasty motherfuckers. Oh, God, what's wrong with these people? Look in a tub. Take a mini cattle prod. A taser. A taser or a hook, chat? Taser, taser easily, taser. Take the hook, bro. Taser, I'm going with the taser. The motherfucker got a gun. It not, it's raining, chat. It's raining. The motherfucking, the hook will be useful, bro. What if I sl- no, 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 the extra, the electro electricity. When I taste that motherfucker. So what's the plan? That dumbass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. Okay, you ready? <sighs> take the hook, take the hook, 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 hook. Hook is good for the situation. Okay, all right. Well, hurry up. We only got one shot at this. Okay, okay, okay. Well, hold on one second, bro. Let me just get the hook. Yeah. I'm gonna hook that motherfucker's eyeballs out his head. Come on. Okay, you ready? Why don't you take the taser? We could do... We could double team him. Yeah, let's go. Stay close. Let's go. Mm hmm what's taking mama and Andy so long? Who are they? Finishing the damn dinner first? Could have brought me out of plate at least. Hey, what are you doing outside <gasps> the barn? Oh shit! Just guarding the place like you said. Well, quit sitting out in the rain like a damn weirdo. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep, and kill the rest. Can I pick which one to keep alive? Not the kid. Not enough meat on the tray. <laughs> oh, I know, Mabel. This is Lee, my favorite to part, too. When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> they never even look down. Oh, shit. That motherfucker's setting traps. No. Tell me what's going on. Bro, he set a bear trap. I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. Uh. I'll keep an eye on him. Be ready to act when I say. I'll keep an eye on him. Be ready to act when I say. See what he's doing now. How do I gotta look? <gasps> what the fuck panic? I froze like a bitch. <sighs> Grab the gun. Give me that. Hook him. Ah! Ah! 
Who told me to take the hook? Yeah, stick with that bitch. Yeah. Let's eat his leg now. Chop it off, Kenny. I'm hungry. I didn't get to Where's eat this my dinner. Family, asshole. You can't have him. We need the vet. No! Cat! Lee, come on! Just go. I won't be far behind. Yeah. I won't be far behind. Ah, you see? Are we gonna kill him? You understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Give part of yourself so others can live. That's why you killed the woman? That's why you killed that woman in the woods. She was about to spill everything. You weren't ready to hear yet, Lee. Had to stop her. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like he didn't kill Jolene. Oh, you don't really? Have what it takes. I don't have what it takes, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Coward. I'm a coward, coward. Hold this, bitch. Ah! Oh, shit, Clem. Close your eyes, Clem. Close up. I didn't know Clem was there. Don't know, Clem. I'm oh, no. God, no. Gotcha. Just go. I'll keep Clementine safe. Yeah, right. You're probably going to drop a brick on her like I bricked your daddy. You better keep her safe. Take the pitchfork. Stab someone else. Fuck it. Oh, yeah, sneaky boy. Kenny. This is, I don't have a good feeling about any of this, bro. Oh, shit. Oh. Carly. The Carly. goat. The goat. Ow. We heard screams as we were coming up to the house. Oh my god. They attacked us! I knew it. I told you we couldn't trust them. Shit. How many of them are there? Two left. Where? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? I was kind of- still got Duck and Katja in the house. And I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right. We're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Carly's a real one. I'm so... Fuck Doug. Fuck Doug. No one even likes Doug. I made a, ra a great choice. Oh my God. Where's Kenny? Oh, I'm gonna take the boy and check around. No, please don't take my boy. Let's go, woman. Set her down. Andy? <gasps> Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? Um. Yeah, it's me. Oh, God. Oh. Come I... here. Let me go! Lee! Get back! Don't come in here! You just had to go snooping around and jump! Let her go, Brenda! Where the fuck is Kenny? Brenda, listen, we could talk about it, Brenda. You don't want to do that. You got to eat, right? Please don't you take another step. Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us. This isn't like you, Brenda. Come on. This isn't like you. Put the gun down. Stop right there. I mean it. Brenda. It doesn't have to end like this. Think about what you're doing. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just <gasps> let me go. Oh, my Mark. Is that Mark? Stay back. Don't do anything stupid. Listen, just, just go upstairs, Brenda. Let her go, Brenda. Please, listen to him. Mark, grab that bitch's hair. I'll do it. Please. Mark, reach. Reach more, Mark. You legless bastard! You, you, you're one of the kindest people I know. You came, you fed us, you took care of us. Please don't make this any worse. Come on, just think just about stop. it. Stop! Listen, listen, just, you're, you're so kind and, 
and Mark grabbed that bitch's hair! Look at that motherfucker's face. He hungry. Grab that bitch. Yeah! Yeah! Right that bitch! Where's Kenny? I said don't move, asshole! Don't you fucking hurt him! Oh my god. Let him go, goddammit! Oh, fuck. That ain't gonna happen. Shoot him! Go, shut up! Oh, Kenny! Shoot Duck too! I know you have more bullets! Who the fuck do you people think you are? Look at what you've done! Listen, shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! You think I'm playing here, boy? All we wanted was gas! We came to you peacefully! Yeah, Carly! Fuck him up! Fuck him up! Oh, bitch! Fuck your two fists! Knock his teethies out! Lee, get up, Lee! Get up, Lee! Ah! Lee, get up, Lee! Get up! Get the fuck up! Lee, you're getting washed! In front of Carly, get up! Oh my god! Go, 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 go! Help! Carly! Carly! Ah! Carly! Lily! Lily, do something, bitch! That's how you feel! That's why your daddy dead! That's why your daddy dead, bitch! Uh, I do it myself. I do it myself. You wanna fuck with me? Bitch! Bitch! Mmm, what's up? Mmm! Mmm! What's up about that? What's up about that? Bitch! Mmm, mink! Mink, you wanna eat Mark's legs? Mink! Oh, I should stop, but I'm not gonna! Mmm! I'm not fucking gonna! I'm crazy, dog. You know what you fucking with? I'm crazy. <sighs> you better ask about me in these streets. <sighs> Little bitch. Is that all you got, Lee? <laughs> you ain't shit. Is that all I got? <sighs> it's over. <sighs> Fuck you. <sighs> As soon as Danny and Mama get out here, you, you all fucked. <laughs> okay, no, yeah. When they come out, how about they're both dead? They're both dead. What did you do? What the fuck did you do? Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee. Fuck you. You're nothing. Get back here and finish this, Lee! <sighs> Clementine, close your eyes! I got to do what I gotta do. What's up? Put your hands up, bitch! <laughs> Oh shit, did I fuck that up? Was that me? Oopsie. I'm sorry. Clem, it's okay, Clem. I had to do what I had to do. They're getting in. Oh fuck. Let's go. Stupid motherfucker, why is everybody calling me dumb? Why am I dumb for killing them? Why am I dumb? He touched my gangster. He's talking about some, come back here, Lee. You won't do it, Lee. You ain't shit, Lee. 
Huh? Lee does what Lee wants, and Lee wanted to kill you. I don't give a fuck about Clem's traumatizations. Character building, like someone in chat said. Clem, don't ask me a dumb question, Clem. You know how I'm feeling right now. Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Bro, yes. <sighs> yeah, and Clementine almost ate some. But? I stopped her. I can't leave her alone, Carly. This fucking world now. It's hiding just unspeakable shit at every turn. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Oh, yeah. shit. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? Hmm. We fucked up. I'm with you. I'm with you, Kenny. We'll do what has to be done. You're damn right. Listen, that RV back at the Motor Inn is just about ready. I've changed my mind. I want you to come with us when we leave. Really? Yeah? Hell yeah. We're a team, man. Me and you. That's right. Taking out Larry before he turned, you saved all of us in that meat locker. And that saved my family, too. Yeah. I'd say you earned it. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. I mean, he decided to take us, though. To kill those men. Was this motherfucker Kenny just gonna leave us? Was this asshole gonna leave us, bro? He ain't shit. That's why I don't feed Duck. That's why I don't like his kid. I'm sorry you saw that. I'm sorry you had to see that, but I only did it to protect us. Because they tried to hurt us? Yes. Okay. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? Probably a zombie duck. Sounds like a car. Oh god, not more strangers. It's an open car door, what the fuck? Come out or I'll shoot. Come out or I'll shoot! Approach the car slowly. What the fuck? Hello? Biggest. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. Oh, take all that. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. Get over it. Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? Oh my god, Clem, please. What if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? Oh my god. We have to take this, Clementine. You're right, we shouldn't take this. Clem's right, okay? But we are living in a post-apocalyptic world with zombies, bro. Side with her, she'll love you. You're right, no, bro, I've been doing Clem. Dude, Clem seemed like, um, I, I can't, I can't do any more bad shit in front of Clem. I can't do it. You're right, we shouldn't take it. You're right, we shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. I don't want any part of it. We've already done enough damage. We've done enough damage already. What do you mean by that? Come on, Kenny. Between this and the meat locker, you know what it means. Fine. Suit yourself. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Okay. What have we got in here? Look, there's more food in that box. 
They have antibiotics. It's okay, Clem. We're gonna starve together, and I'll probably See eat you. See if there's you. any water. I stole their recipe. Yeah. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Lee, there's a hoodie in here. Could probably fit Clementine. She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. It's gonna get cold out eventually. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Hmm? Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What happened? Oh, fuck no. Why are they breathing that heavy? Oh. Jake, Bart, Linda, and all y'all fucking sickos from the save lots. They call y'all bandits, but you're fucking rapists, what? Oh, darling baby, look at you. Look at you. Oh, you need a mama, sweetheart. We won't let them bandits get you, will we? No. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. This is. I promise. If you're I'll thinking find it, you're I'll safe, you know. sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you gotta be afraid of. The people I used to call friends. The people who do. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. <gasps> I promise. Oh shit. They ain't gonna have food from the dairy no more, bro. Next time. Megan is done, pal. Ain't nothing left. Is this all you got? I, maybe people out yeah, there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. This is crazy. I'm the one keeping this group going. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else. Only 17% killed both the brothers. Am I a bad person? What what happened there? I didn't why didn't everybody kill him? I thought they were thought that was the one. Chop David's leg off. Hell yeah, everybody chopped that shit off. Only 31% killed Larry? Did it what? Who wouldn't want to kill Larry? You would think that would be like the 80%. YouTube outro. Wow, YouTube, I hope you enjoyed this episode of The Walking Dead. Ooh. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. If you made it this far, comment chicken nuggets that's that's all i got for you